Do you have an MVP vote this year, Hub? I do. Yeah, I'm one of the AP. There's 50 of us who vote, and I am one of us. And are you? did you reveal that you're not voting for Aaron Rodgers? Is that correct? I did. Yeah, I, I mean, I've been pretty consistent about that all year. Um, I don't think you can be the biggest jerk in the league and punish your, your team and your organization and your fan base the way he did and be the most valuable player. It, it, has he been the most valuable on the field? Yeah, you could make that argument, but I don't think he is – clearly that much more valuable than than Jonathan Taylor or uh, or Cooper Cup or, or maybe even Tom Brady and and so from where I sit the rest of it is why he's not going to be my choice do I think he's going to win it probably you know the, the, a lot of the voters don't don't approach it the same way that I do others do who I've spoken to um, but one of the, the, the ways we get to keep being voters is we're not allowed to say who we are voting for until after the award has been announced. I'm probably pushing the envelope by saying who I'm not voting for, um, but we're, we're not really supposed to reveal our votes. Are they supposed to, are off-field things like vaccination status supposed to factor in or are there no guidelines for that? There's no guidelines. Uh, you know, we are told to pick the guy who we think is the most valuable to his team. And, and um, the, you know, I, I don't think it says anywhere, you know, strictly on the field. Uh, although I do think he hurt his team on the field, uh, you know, by, by the way he acted off the field. Uh, you know, I mean, they're going to get the number one seed anyway. But what if the difference had come down to uh, to the Chiefs game, you know, where he lied about being vaccinated and, and, and you know, ended up not playing and they got beat. So uh, I think all these things should be considerations. That, that's the way I look at it. He ruined the entire off season for that football team. They were left in jeopardy. They had no idea what they were doing. Um, uh, a, a lot of the off the field stuff was wasted because he wasn't there. He tortured his fan base um, uh, and he's and he's getting ready. He's already started doing it again. Oh, he, so, you know, so, he, and, so he couldn't have won the MVP before the season for you. For me, no. Yeah, no. I, I just think that that the way he's carried himself is inappropriate, and and, and you know the, the 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 vaccine thing just was one more, you know, log on the fire, so to speak. I I think he's a bad guy, you know, and I don't think a bad guy can be the most valuable valuable guy at the same time.